Whew. Oh my god. God. It is so hot. Florida is the hottest place. Sticky. It's like the sun. It's like the rainforest. It's almost like the Congo. The, yes, like the... I got it. What, what? I know a game we're going to play next. What are we going to play? Donkey Kong Country. Donkey Kong Country, guys. Welcome back. Welcome back to hey. the next series of Wine Court. Uh, so yeah, we had our contest a little bit ago, and uh, you guys were right. Uh, we are playing a Donkey Kong game. Uh, although there was only one of you guys who was right on which game it was specifically. Yeah, a few different Donkey Kong guesses. Yeah. One was correct. Yeah, a lot of people thought it was Donkey Kong 64, mm -hmm. uh, which was a pretty good guess. Yeah. Uh, you know, we did a lot of like banana kind of things happening in there, but it was Donkey Kong Country, uh, and so that is going to go out to our very good friend, Donut. Donut. That's his second victory yeah, two, in our series. Two times that Donut yeah. has claimed victory on our contest. Uh, so kudos to you, but uh, this time, instead of going ahead and opening up our first bottle of wine, uh, you know, and honoring it for you, instead we have this really nice, awesome drink right over here, uh, which we actually call the Bananas Congo. Mm. Uh, it's our take on a, a Bananas Foster. Bananas Foster is one of my favorite foods uh, ever. It's delicious, banana-y, it's everything that Donkey Kong would love. Uh, but we decided to add a little bit more of a Donkey Kong spin to it. Uh, and we're actually going to show you in a minute about how you can make one of your very own. It's going to be a really nice chocolatey, banana-y, hazelnut, creamy, just perfect beverage that you can have. It's it's perfect for a soda shop for adults. Absolutely. This is how I feel. And I love those kind of drinks. So. All right. So here we go. We're going to have a little bit of our Bananas Congo. And cheers to you, Donut, for winning our contest. Cheers to Donut. Clink, clink. <sighs> oh, yeah. That's fantastic. And it has a Donkey Kong punch. It does. Followed with very calm flavors. All right. Mm -hmm. So here's how you guys at home can make your very own Bananas Congo. Hey guys, we're going to teach you how to make a Bananas Congo. First, you're going to take a nice big mug and you're going to give it a chocolate drip all along the side, make it look like a barrel. You'll have extra chocolate in the bottom to flavor your beverage. Okay. Now again, just like last time, we don't have a tumbler with us. You're welcome to use a tumbler to be more professional. We, on the other hand, are not. And we're gonna measure it out in a shot glass and pour it in. But follow these measurements. Um, you're gonna start with about an ounce of uh, creme de cacao, your chocolate liqueur. Okay. Followed by another ounce of uh, banana liqueur, we're using 99 bananas, uh, but you can use any banana liqueur you like. But we thought this was the most appropriate liquor. You're gonna use a half an ounce of spiced rum. We went fancy tonight, but any spiced rum again will work. But a half an ounce there. And about an ounce um, of Kahlua hazelnut. Now for Angelico could work as well. We went for a little coffee hazelnut flavor, um, but a Frangelico or Kahlua hazelnut is fine. Okay. Followed by about two ounces of creamer. Little drip there. Okay. If you're not using the tumbler, you're gonna be stirring. Now careful not to mess up the chocolate rim around the side. Um, you're gonna then take a couple pinches of cinnamon sugar. Pour those in there, stir them again, trying not to mess up your chocolate if you're stirring it in the glass, not with a tumbler. Finally, you're gonna take a whole banana as your garnish. It wouldn't be, it wouldn't be a Bananas Congo without Dr. Kong's favorite. Uh, gently put that in there, and I'll keep in mind, your beverage will rise. I have a little bit more to top it off. A little banana there. And finish it off with DK's favorite color, his red tie, a nice red bendy straw. Ooh. And there you have, oh, as well, sorry. You're gonna put a little bit of a pinch of cinnamon sugar. I like to put it around in the top of the drink, as well as on the banana itself. Now, while you're drinking this, we would recommend accompanying it with a spoon. As you go further on in the drink, you can take off little pieces of the alcohol-soaked banana 
and incorporate that into your beverage. But here is your Bananas Congo. Enjoy. Oh my God, God, that is a good drink. That was really good. Ooh, okay. yeah. I guess I'm just gonna kind of just grab this banana here. I don't have a fancy spoon like you. You just go and wash kinda, No, it's okay. I got chocolate. It's good. Mm-hmm. It's really good. All right, well, you know what? After fueling up oh, hey. with a banana, with all of this chocolate, banana, hazelnut, all this awesome goodness, I am ready to start throwing some barrels, beating up some crocodiles. I'm ready for some Donkey Kong Country. Mm -hmm. Are you ready? Yeah, yeah. You all ready for that? Yes. Hey guys, welcome to, welcome back in our first episode of our Donkey Kong Country series here at Wine Corp. Uh, I'm Matt, here with Hero. Hey guys. Uh, here we go, the classic intro. Oh my god, this uh, takes I love me his, back to this little phonogram. See, I love his music. Yeah, Cranky Kong is awesome. Right, forget the rap part. Yeah, or no, like we'll the, wait the, for it. Here we go. What a piece of shit. What a dick, Not only does right? he mess up a perfectly good phonogram, right. but he beats the shit out of his own dad. His, well, I think it's his uncle. Is it his gra uncle? Grandpa Cranky? I think uh, it's his it, Well, it's Cranky Kong. I don't know Cranky if they say... Kong. I think it's his grandfather. But I think all it's right, his here grandfather. We go. 1994, man. I was three years old. Holy shit. All right, so here we go. We're going to do two-player team, because we're seven. nice. I was seven years old. Gee, I, Matt is old as hell. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> all right, time to go into the Congo jungle. Uh, now, so to get us started, uh, yes. we do have our first our wine first of the night. Um, because when I, I chose the wine for tonight, I told a story. You enjoyed the story. I, I really did. It, it, Matt has a gift for this. Thanks. This is why I've chosen him. <laughs> so the wine tells a story. So our first wine is the Creme de Lape. We start with our hero, the great ape himself. Uh, me, Hero. I'm Hero. That's my name. <laughs> our hero, who is an ape. I wouldn't say great Thanks. ape. I'd say you're like a just an, like a dirty, stinky. I don't. Ape. I don't like this. Okay. Anymore. <laughs> Sorry. So we start with our ape, Creme de Ape. Um, it is a, a Piedmont Cortese, uh, which is a, a white wine. It's very pungent. I'd say like it has a. a you smell it. It's, it's a very yeah. It has strong like a, nose to it. Yeah. Uh, I'm not I'm not on the up and up with the official words of how you describe wine and stuff. I describe it how I seize it. I would say pungent is a good word. Thank it, you. Yeah, right? Like it, if it has... I were to give folks at home advice who might have went out yeah. uh, to buy this wine, to have the same wines as we did, because we, you know, we put this up in the contest. Also, uh, hashtag another shout out to Donut. Um, it, I wouldn't spend a lot of time smelling this wine, guys. It has a very unique it, well, aroma kinda, it, to it. It, it. it reminds me of a lot of cheeses that you don't yeah. want to smell them, but they have their flavor. And now a Cortese is something, it's it's a white wine that you, from tasting this, you, you have to, it's one of those like acquired tastes. Okay. It's not like a Chardonnay where you're going to, ooh, it's buttery. It's, it's, this one has its own kind of bam flavor in the mouth, not to steal the, the motto of a, a certain chef. It's actually, okay, so uh, much like a lot of things taste like what they smell like, I mean, this, this definitely, does not. No, it does. Like, to me, it Are tastes so? like its, its nose, but really? it, it actually, it goes down nicely, like, on the tongue as opposed to, like, through your nose. Hmm. Uh, but all right, so so we got our, our so creme del ape, and we ape. are ready to roll. Um, now for the, so we, we have a cheese pairing for it. Uh, we ourselves are not eating it right now. Because we ate a lot of tacos, we had a big dinner while we were setting everything up for today. Yeah, it was it was like a Taco Wednesday. Um, kind of but thing. the cheese to pair with this, uh, look, I, this this is the audience's reaction right now. Ah, oh, uh, shut right? up, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I love. I just go back in and back. Like I just love that scene. Um, so at home, if if you're getting this, if you're gonna get our pair and drink <laughs> along with us, I recommend it. it it's amazing. It's an herbal. Honey infused. Oh, I forgot that you could do this. Pecorino Romano. Um, it's gonna be a bit crumbly. It's gonna counter this this pungent smell and good flavor with a, an infused honey flavor as well, um, and herbs. Uh, uh, so I would recommend that. Find that because my mouth is water right now. I, I almost wish I didn't eat so many tacos so we could be eating that right uh, now. I wanted to get the, the the balloon. Yeah, you would you would <laughs> want to, but but I'm uh, garbage at this. <laughs> Oh, I can't get up there. Trump! <laughs> yeah, oh my god, the sound effects in this game are incredible. Wait, 
Wait a minute. No, no it wasn't that no. one. No, you know what I'm it's, talking it's, about, though. Uh, so for are there any that face that way? I think they all always face forward, right? The Do they really? caves. I don't know. I'm trying to think if there's any that... That fucking vulture. Uh, I'm trying to remember if there's any that face backwards. Uh, so for the record, um, you know, Donkey Kong Country is one of the single most classic... There's one here. There's definitely one here. Right down there. Oh, no, oh, no! Whoops. The wall, not the pit. All right, man. Well, well you're in charge now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am. I think so. The Diddy is in first, so I think that means you're you're controlling. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. I I think. Oh, hold on. Press select. Like, yeah, the the, the yeah, select. Yeah. Okay. 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 Do it again. Yeah. There so you go. we can tag in. Oh, yeah, that works. If we think it's too difficult. Oh well. Uh, yeah, you, you gotta hold it if you want to take it with you. Um. But oh, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> so I this game. Again. This game is super classic. Uh. Because of like the type of uh, like pre-rendered image that they used in the background, uh, it, it like created a precedent for a lot of SNES games of the time. That's what I was talking about. There we go. Uh, but yeah, so we thought nothing would be more appropriate for Winecore than you know playing a super classic game like this. See how I got that balloon? I got it successfully. But yeah, from the music. Oh, oh nice. We already got. Oh, okay. Well, that was fast. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you got. You gotta get him. All right, after the ostrich, I... don't fuck this up. Oh, oh you on, man. I don't talk. You know, you had one job. Don't talk. I'm the one who's throwing my hat on the ground in front of don't you, sir. Don't talk. I was trying to. <laughs> don't talk on don't... a YouTube show where we exclusively talk. Well, not when I'm trying to concentrate <laughs> about me. Con there's, I think there's, can't there can't was one here. Right? No, I guess not. All right, well, we did it. Uh, I'd say da. rule of thumb, the only time don't talk is when the person's trying to concentrate. Matt, I was doing the little dance. You are, yeah. Doing. It's, all right, ropey right, rampage. So your, you you want to go this one, or is it still? No, you, you can go. You can go, go until go. you die. Don't worry. This game definitely oh. kicks the shit out of you immediately. Oh, I know. I know. Yeah, this game is is pretty notorious for being difficult. I should have to get that. Okay, I don't know if it's just me. I used to love that buyer effect when I was yeah. a kid. I, I don't know. It makes the me feel like I'm like an sound. arson or something. But <laughs> oh, okay. Well, oh, damn it. <laughs> uh, I, don't, I wasn't going that far. I just enjoy the, the effect. But sure. Yeah, arson. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, shit. Up, 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 oh! up. Whoa! Don't forget the banana. We need those to make some more bananas congos. <laughs> oh, that's so good. <laughs> oh, my God. It was fantastic. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, <laughs> well, that, that worked. Right that worked. Them. <laughs> I totally meant to. It, it's from all the days of, of Diddy being a stripper and climbing these ropes and these poles. There's no, nothing can stop him. <laughs> Leave no banana I, behind. Hell no. <laughs> it's I, like the military I, mantra of these guys. If you remember from our Sonic series, I'm like, I have to get everything. <laughs> I don't know why. You're just sitting there with the banana that has a bruise on you. You're just like, don't you die on me, <laughs> damn it. Me. Clear. <laughs> oh my god. This music and everything about this game is just bringing my entire childhood back to me. Right? Oh, so good. And all of these I the, think, fucking armadillo assholes. So I don't think I've ever talked about I this on the was show a, before. No, I guess not. You know, I've been attacked by an armadillo once. Are you serious? Yeah. That's so, amazing. Okay. <laughs> so I was at a, I I was at a, a, a Taco Bell at like 3 in the morning <laughs> This with my is buddies. getting better. Uh, <laughs> so it's like 3 in the morning, and we're about to pull up into the drive-thru, and right before we're like the, like the little... Those fucking bees, I hate those bees. The, uh, the how box, do I, do I you, guess, how, do I, how do I do this? Do Here. what? To get the stuff out of the ground, the hidden. Oh, oh down in Y. I don't know if you can do that. Oh, okay, so stop with me. Select. Yeah. yeah. No, you need like a thing. Need an animal. I think. Well, I I think what you need to do is you need to like like land on it, like like from a height, uh, and then you land on it, and then it comes out. I got gotcha. you. Um, but yeah, so so I'm at I'm at Taco Bell. What, the, what was that? It was the armadillo. He ah, sniper shoot. shot you from behind. I didn't even see him coming. Oof. Gotta I dodge these guys. Bees. Yeah, I hate those guys. Boom. I love that sound effect of you beating somebody mm. up. Hey, nice. Oh, 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 oh. oh no. No. Oh, 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 I wanted to kill him. No. What a that? And he looks at the camera too. There like He's like, ha, I got you. There was a G. All right, that's you, buddy. You, you gotta survive and, and so you can get a deep true survivor. <laughs> Just run into it, with <laughs> yes, it. but somehow miraculously you're okay. That's my method. <laughs> oh, I did it. Oh, again. right there, right there. Just, oh, oh. oh my, oh my god. god! Just get the barrel. <laughs> I know, but he's there. Get it, get it, get it. Just throw it, throw it. 
Oh, you killed it from <laughs> I behind! Did. I did. <laughs> I'm an expert barrel. Oh my god. Killer? So, um, murder? <laughs> uh. But yes, yeah, so, so we go up to like the voice box at um, at Taco Bell. <laughs> oh no! God damn it! That was me, guys. I admit that right, was me. So we go to the voice box, the one where you're just like, "Hey, can I take it his?" And yeah. um, right before we got up to it, there was a uh, uh, there was an armadillo like on the floor. So we didn't want to, you know, drive over him. Uh, right. Let me go ahead and throw this at so this guy. So, so, so we got out of our car, thinking and like we were it was just a turtle. Like, uh, you would do. You would pick up a turtle. And well, move it. I mean, we. Uh, <laughs> You're giving us way too much credit. That's assuming we actually wanted to like help this creature, which oh, was God. not our intention. Uh, no, we wanted to take a picture of it. Oh jeez. Um, so, so we got out of out of the car and we were gonna take a picture of, of this of this dude. Yeah. And um. Yeah. Get out of here. Okay. Get the G. Um, get the G. I don't know if I can. Oh I, yeah, I needed to bounce off of him. Um. So we got out of the car and and you know, th these creatures they're kind of like skittish and whatnot. So uh, do Cranky's cabin. I ain't got nothing left. <laughs> so don't even ask. Yeah, you can't ask for shit. You beat the crap out of him in the opening. A leap of faith is all it takes. And find Winky in Barrel Cannon Canyon. I, Barrel Cannon Canyon? Cannon Canyon. Can that's what it was. Yeah, that's what I like If you that. bounce a keg off a wall, well, he just has no time for our shit. Make sure to shut the gate on your way out. I didn't raise you in a, in a barn. What an asshole. He raised you in a tree. <laughs> So yeah, so so we kind of did like a pincer strike on this uh, armadillo. We like came at it from okay. all three sides to try to take this clever, picture of it. You clever girl. Did. Exactly. Okay. And so it turned around and was like, I need to get the fuck out of Dodge. Oh God. So it turns around and it starts running up to my leg. And then it starts just going ape shit. Like no <laughs> oh, pun shit. intended for us playing Donkey Kong Country. Ah, uh, well done. But it went absolutely crazy on me. Oh, 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 oh. what? You somehow Aha. killed that last one, Waylon. And so it like it runs, it oh, runs God. at me and rushes uh -huh. my legs, and then it like starts to like circle my legs, butt itself into me. <laughs> like I feel like it was trying to nibble itself at sure. my uh, sure. at my pants, and then I ran into that car. I mean, armadillos are actually very nasty animals. And they, I, I they're never mean. knew that. I, mean. I thought they were nice. Yeah, no, no, they're mean. Poop. They're mean. <laughs> Oh, oh no! Live on, brother. I hate these jumpers. Oh no! I, oh, oh I used dude, he got you with like he. That was like a flying crane kick to your face. I uh, I used the wrong. Uh, oh, yeah. You did. You you did the dingles. I did the dingles. Don't worry, man. I got you. <laughs> I I use you for my own. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. I like that you were rolling with the barrel. You were going with the barrel. Oh, we missed this last time. Yeah. Got myself a life call, to make up for the call. one that we lost. <laughs> yeah. Get under the barbed wire, son! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! That was cool. <laughs> what was that? Dude, what kind of 90s reaction did we just have? I've done right. that with Zach before, but never with you. And that was, like, unironic. <laughs> no, we were legitimately... <laughs> I mean, this brings me back to the 90s, so... Oh my gosh, I used to remember playing this game as a kid in West Palm Beach. Uh, with my... Uh, oh yeah? Yeah, with, with my cousin. At his we... house, like, we would play this in the middle of the night. We, um, growing up, I think we talked about with Sonic, but I had, I had the Sega Genesis. And, um, shortly after this time, I got N64 not too long after this, but I had the Sega Genesis, and my best friend at the time, the girl next door, had, oh, whoa. had the, shout out to you, Sammy, <laughs> had the, um, Super Nintendo, and I remember going over to her house all the time, and, and we'd be playing this and stuff, and I loved it. And so, yeah, that's that's my memory of playing this, is at her place, you know. See, my memory was playing uh, this game and uh, uh, the old school Lemmings. Like the original oh Lemmings. Yes. And, uh, and Super Mario 2. Uh, on, you know, on, on the various Get consoles, I, I played uh, Mario 2 on, like, the right. Mario All-Stars. Why'd it have to be used snakes? To be <laughs> <laughs> but, um... I, uh, I, I used to play that, and uh, at my old house in West Palm Beach, we had an alarm system, right? Okay. But it was like, back then in the day, alarm systems aren't the way they are now. No. They're like, they're kind of crappy. Right. Um, and so back then, it was like a grid of lasers that would be like a, a height. Wait, you legitimately had like a laser? like. Well, because it was the motion sensor, but the way the motion sensor works is it's like a laser that right. goes out, but it oh, goes up that. to yeah. a certain height. Yep. So we would Did come you ever out of our Catherine room. Zeta Jones it? Well, we didn't Catherine Zeta Jones. Oh, ah. here we go. But um, no, what we would do is we would like army crawl underneath where we knew the height of the lasers were, and we would crawl all the way to the kitchen, and we would make strawberry Nesquik. <laughs> in, in, in yeah, it was specifically strawberry Nesquik in mugs that were the heads of the Ninja Turtles. 
Nice. And, and, and then we would army crawl back. I remember back. those mugs. Yeah. Holy shit. I remember those mugs. Yeah. Yeah. And then we'd go back and it was, you know, like midnight, two in the morning playing right. Donkey Kong Country, like this level specifically because of the water levels kicked the crap out of you. Oh my God. And, uh, and, every, and, and drinking any strawberry next quick. Oh, here's my boy. You remember I, his name? On guard. On guard. He's yeah. the, the only animal's name. Oh, uh, well, the ostrich is speedy or quicky or something. Yeah. What, what is the rhino's name? I don't remember. The, the only one I definitely remember is on guard. Um, oof. Yeah, oh. I, I'm going. You got to go with the octopus. All right, all right. Oh wait, what? Yeah, that's Where'd why you go? don't go with the octopus. I didn't want to get hit. I didn't want to lose my. But boy. it goes away. But I needed my boy. Oh, do you, <laughs> does he like pop it or something? I think so. Does yeah. he pop it and or I lock it? <laughs> he pop locks and then he drops. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Into the abyss. <laughs> um. <laughs> into I, into I the even, nether. Uh, no. I don't even remember what we were talking about. But you know, uh, my favorite animal. Fun fact. You know, what my favorite animal is what? Ostrich. Really? Always. My whole that life. That is an interesting thing. It is my favorite animal. Yeah. So I love this game because I could ride an ostrich. Oh, that's cool. Uh, when I was, uh, I mean, still now, my, my favorite animal is the red panda. Oh, nice. Yeah. Those are adorable. I, I, I went to, um, I went to uh, Georgia recently, and I got right. to go to like the aquarium, and I also got to go to uh, uh, the the Atlanta Zoo. And I didn't know, going like getting to the Atlanta Zoo, that they had a red panda there because I mean the only other place I've ever seen one. Uh, Cause you know they're they're used to like snowy climates and like you know it being cold. Uh, yeah. Was San Diego Zoo. Okay. Uh, but we got into the in, into the zoo and uh, my girlfriend Lexi she like showed me a uh, uh, the map. And there you saw a red. And, panda. and there was a picture of a panda. I was like, Did you? Oh squeak? god! I like almost dropped. Did the, you squee? Yeah, I did. And uh, I'm, I'm here. I'll, I'll post a picture uh, of the red panda right here. Like, see? Yeah. It's there the it cutest is. thing ever Aww. on the planet. I'm totally seeing it's that adorable. right now. Yeah, no, we're absolutely seeing it. I'm <laughs> seeing it in my heart right now and Aww. in my head. Uh, so here's this guy. Yeah, what was his name? Funky Kong? Yeah, right? yeah, Funky Kong. Funky yeah. Kong's barrel flights. That's right. Yeah, he has bodacious jumbo, ba jumbo barrels that can launch you to any he, point in the island. He is the epitome of the 90s. Yep. Right there. That guy is radical. But yeah, th this guy is super handy for um, transporting you quickly through right. the levels. And he's got a fucking awesome tune. We had no reason to use him right now. We just really wanted to show you his... Double kill. <laughs> Back in the day... Oh, you missed the tree. You uh, missed uh, oh, the no, tree. Oh, no, I don't think you can. Can you not? Oops. No, yeah, you really I, I, can I when you do that. I, I, I couldn't... Yeah, it, it gives you a minute to press a button so that it doesn't oh, yeah. just kill oh, you immediately. Shoot, shoot. Just get yeah, run underneath him. <laughs> just oh, well, that's, see, oh, see, that, that's how you're supposed to get up. Oh, I see. Yeah, because you can't move over to the right fast enough. Oh, shoot. Oh, well. Uh, what's up there? What do we need? No, no, don't worry about it. Just just go. It's not something yeah, important? No, 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 no. It's, it's like bonus oh, stuff. I keep hitting the right... All right, forget it. I keep hitting the wrong button. Yeah. Just, just roll. Oh, it. it's the yeah. yeah it's, it's a that. barrel that'll shoot you across. Boom! Hey, we took one of these today. <laughs> we did. Yeah. That was took, crazy. Took I didn't know you had one. Uh, you know, I think my favorite thing about these uh, these barrels is that they don't um, they 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 don't like dishevel you like your hair or your clothes or anything like that. Like it just you're right. Like we were. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? That's the way to travel. I'm gonna say it. Dude, this is. So like this song obviously reminds me of Donkey Kong Country, there but it go. also reminds me of the original Smash Brothers. When he played in yeah. Jungle Japes. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, what did I do <laughs> wrong? Oh, you're not running. Oh. Yeah, you, you gotta get that cartwheel yeah. going and then hold down that thing and jump. Uh, well, don't worry about it. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, my, my rule is always hold, always hold run. In any game, always yeah. be holding run. I normally do, but in this game, for some reason, I just, I have a habit of not. Dude, if you don't get that, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shut your face. <laughs> That's all that matters. I, in the last round, I got all the letters. You had just had to get one. Dude, you, you can't even spell. <laughs> Shut up. You're I'm lucky back. that I can bring I'm you back. back to life. I'm Boom. back. All right, now if I'm not mistaken, There's... it's actually here. No, oh, you no. stupid son! <laughs> oh no! Damn it! You're, oh. You shamed us all. Oh my god. All right. You Commit know what? Seppuku. You know what? Let's come back to this next time on Winecore. Do Yay, a little cartwheel for the yay. fans. Yay! Bye guys. Bye guys. Bye guys.